hello, hello. This is Barbara from Me and All My Nerdiness. What's up, what's up? Alright, it's been a while since y'all seen me. Sorry, my lighting is not that great in here. But I'm doing this on a movie that I just watched. I've met the producer and one the star of the movie. Um, the movie is Dormant. I hope I said it. Yeah, Dormant. <laughs> I just finished watching it. I have started watching it a while ago and I stopped because I wanted to take a moment and actually sit down and be able to watch it and enjoy the movie without my little people interrupting me so I had a day off and so that's what I got to do today so first of all I want to say great job on this movie it's very very it's a very good movie um and I'm getting all my takeaways from the movie again it's called Dormant the star and producer is Julian J. Burton yes I have notes because I have to keep up he plays Detective Long in the movie then you have um Tom Hagel I'm sorry if I mispronounce your name I'm horrible with names he plays Mr. Arthur Huff now when I started watching the movie honestly I got a little bit of Inception vibes if you know me Inception is my all-time favorite favorite movie I say that because of the flashbacks and different thing that goes on the movie I don't want to give too many things away but I am going to tell you it's a great movie there were a lot of flashbacks of Detective Long was having of his wife his daughter and then when he got to the scene where I found out what was happening and why he was doing that it was like oh my god that was dope I also had a little face off action with Arthur Huff. I was like, I call it face off action. It's not necessarily face off. It's a little more complicated than face off. But yeah, I thought that was kind of dope how I threw that in that little Machiavelli type thing. So I was like, oh man, that was super dope. Um, what I like about the movie, it keeps you on your toes, it keeps you thinking, it keeps you guessing, trying to figure out who is who, what's going on. Um, one thing I did find funny in the movie was the fact like when Detective Long or I'm sorry, London moved in and his neighbor brought a cat over like, hey, I'm trying to get rid of a cat. Me instinctively being the person that I am, that I am like just not super trusting in people. I found that kind of weird. And the guy was like insisting on giving this man this freaking animal. I'm like that is a key point in this movie it's something about that animal especially when he got his daughter spoiler sorry to bring the animal back and ask him to keep the animal i'm like yeah it's something about this i was like it gotta be a listening device or something and boom come to it spoiler once again it really was um what else i liked about the movie what i did was a little bit more research on it and coming after this movie is i said it was a um a prequel or something to the web series Bermuda City. So y'all definitely want to check that out as well. I haven't started it just yet, but after this video, that's probably what I'm going to do with the rest of my day. Um, what else I got to say? I mean, it was good. The only thing that I would take from it is like the action scene. I love good action. And I feel like the fight scenes could have been a little bit better, a little bit more contact action or something like that. It was just more like, Okay, it's a little fight, but not the fighting that I'm used to in other movies. But still, a great movie. I enjoyed it. I hope y'all do enjoy it. Again, I'm going to post a link um, for y'all to go check out the movie as well. So y'all do that. Go follow or support this. It's a great movie. The um, I don't know what else to say about it. I really did enjoy it. I did give some spoilers. Sorry. I love how it threw a few monkey wrenches in there. It's like, hold on, where is this going? It's not a move that you can't follow. It's easy, real easy to follow, real easy to get from in it. I really personally enjoyed it. Thank y'all. It was nice meeting you, Mr. Burton, and all the cons that I've met you at. I did got to get that comic book. He's also, what is it? Ah, Red Crow Comics. I hope I said that right. Um, so, y'all, look, get at him, follow them. Please go watch and support this movie. It's really good. It's on Amazon Prime. If you don't have Amazon Prime, get it. First of all, I don't understand why you wouldn't have Amazon Prime because Amazon Prime is the bomb. At least try that 30-day trial they got going on. Something, you know. Come on, who don't like two-day shipping? I like, I don't know. I don't get it. Again, this is Barbara. Sorry, my nose itching. From me and all my nerdness, giving y'all my review of the movie Dormant. Yes, I'm late. For all my friends who've already seen it, don't judge me. Y'all know I'm late on everything. I've just seen in games.
few weeks ago, so don't judge me. Alright, peace y'all. <laughs>